let's take a look at the new refurbished gardened area. Ready, set, look. Oh my gosh. This is stunning. How freaking cool is this? Ah, good day everyone and welcome back to another episode of X Life. So, I am here in front of the Five Heart Clubhouse and I've made some adjustments. Now, in the last episode, I was working so freaking hard, I ended up going to like 2 a.m. So, I wasn't able to finish the exterior, but I added some flags, I added some flowers in between episodes, and I think it looks super freaking cute, looks so much better. Like, it definitely needed the flags. So, I'm glad that I added that. And the flowers are all pink, so it fits it ships speaking of fits and ships i don't know how this is a segue at all but hi <laughs> uh i launched a kickstarter page for a board game that i'm creating based off of escape the night season one so if you guys want to be one of the backers and buy the board game i will leave a link down below basically it takes everything from escape the night and brings it into a board game so you guys can experience escape the night at home so i know you guys are going to absolutely freaking love this board game it's one of my favorite ones obviously because i created it so if you want to check it out again the link will be down below we've already surpassed <laughs> the goal like in the first three hours of it being live uh it's just so crazy so if you want to be a part of it and you want to get it again the link is down below it would really mean a lot to me and yeah that's it for that promo moving on to x life so let's go back home shall we and let's discuss what the plan is today so in the last episode aside from making this we went on an adventure oh it looks so freaking cute honestly we need to have contest for best clubhouse because I think five hearts is pretty freaking cool. Okay, so I mentioned that I wanted to create an aquarium full of seahorses and name the seahorses after you if the video got 15,000 likes. Now, I'm filming this the same day that I posted that video and it already has 10,000 likes. So I'm pretty sure by the time this episode comes out, it's going to hit the 15,000 likes. Now, if it doesn't, I will kill all of the seahorses. So don't try me. Okay. I'm giving you guys a little bit of a leeway expecting that you won't do me dirty. So unless you want all these slaughtered seahorses then you better like that video okay so what we need to do is we need to figure out a place for the aquarium now i'm trying to decide if i want it inside my house or outside and i was thinking maybe inside i need to decorate you guys it's like come on Joey. it needs to happen you need to decorate but i was thinking potentially turning this whole section into a interior aquarium which i think could be really cute i'm not really using the space i could easily move these things and i could turn this into a really cute aquarium so i think i might do that let's look at other options i think the other possibility is doing it outside and i could make it real real big but i don't know exactly where i'd want that I guess I could make like a seaside aquarium exhibit maybe. So maybe it like connects to the water so it feels a little bit more like, you know, like a, a safe haven for the seahorses. They can have like a little outdoor area in the water. No, maybe, maybe that's not a good idea. Maybe it should just be all interior. Hmm. Oh my gosh, you guys. I just had a freaking brilliant idea. Sakura, where are you? I hear your meows. Did you also have the same exact idea? Oh, she did. Wow, we're so connected. Come here, let's share our idea. Okay, so Sakura and I have been thinking and we thought it would be so freaking cute since we are doing an Alice in Wonderland. Oh, she's mad, she's mad. She said, how dare you not get a black cat yet in X Life, girl. I'm sorry, I've been busy, and I know I'm getting seahorses next, but you'll be, you're, you know what? I'm going to pencil you in. I'm going to write, I have a list of episode ideas. Sakura, you are, let me just write that down for you. Hold on just a second. Sometimes I doodle in this book, and it's like, girl, what the hell am I doing sometimes? 
Do you guys want to see? I play D and D a lot. Well, I haven't in a while, but sometimes when I'm playing, I'll doodle in this book, and it's kind of embarrassing. Okay, this is truly haunting. What is this? I don't know. I was facing a, a crazy monkey in D and D, and I just started. Look at these freaking doodles. Girl, I have some serious issues. Oh my gosh. I have stuff in here from Crazy Craft. Look at I have the recipes for a cat pet, a chicken pet. Oh my god, this book is old. Okay, I'm trying to find my... This got way off track. I Have I even told you guys what my idea was? <laughs> the suspense! Truly, it must be killing you guys. Okay, I went off way off track. Okay, listen up, y'all. The plan is, it's Alice in Wonderland themed. What if we made a freaking teacup with a tea kettle pouring water in to the freaking cup? And the cup is the fish tank. How sickening. Sickening, no! Very sickening. And now I need to pick a place for that to, to be a thing. And I'm questioning if I should... <sighs> I mean, that's a really cute freaking concept. Like, do I, I feel like right here would be so cute for that. But it, the garden does look nice there. What about if I cut these trees down and I put it here? I think this would be a great area for it. I can make a pathway from here over to the teacup. And then over here can be our teacup slash aquarium area. Now, I don't even know if this is possible or what it's gonna look like, but I think that's such a freaking fantastic idea. If you like that idea, slap that like button, okay? Go on, agree with me, I'll wait. All right, I'm done, I'm done. All right, <laughs> let's just freaking get to it. I'm going for it, I'm gonna chop these trees down, deforestation, whom? Wow, two building episodes in one episode? No, after another, not in one episode. But I feel like a teacup is much easier to make than a full-on structural building. He said, cut to 10 hours later, <laughs> still building. <sighs> uh, okay, I'm gonna let deforestation do its thing. Now, I need to look up some reference images of teacups and kettles and all that stuff in Minecraft, so hold on. Okay, I have the inspiration. I'm ready to do this, but Guys, the thing is, I'm shooting this a couple days before I'm posting it, so I always get so annoyed when people come to my property and they give away my builds. Hasn't really happened, but it has in past series. And also, CPK likes to travel through here a lot in his videos, and he's the type of boy who shoots and posts the same day. So if in between these days walks through he's gonna see it and give it away so what i'm gonna do first is i'm going to go collect a bunch of freaking seahorses so that's the first thing on the agenda but to get the seahorses i'm gonna need a lot of freaking lassos and to have lassos i'm gonna need string so we're gonna make it nighttime and we are going to go and get ourselves some spiderises to get their strings harvested from them let's also eat some food before we make it dark now i'm nervous because nighttime now is much different it's there's very scary things that could apparently one shot you um so let's make it night real quick um let's get a spider and let's call it a day there you are hi sir come here okay let's make it day let's not get any of those pink spiders we good? We good? Ha! Huh, ha! Huh, we survived! Wow! We Hey, Five Heart Club! Looking gorgeous as ever! Sickening the house down boots! Okay, so I'm gonna put this guy in the mob grinder, and once I get a bunch of string, I will make a bunch of leads, and then I'll be back for us to go on an adventure to go collect all the seahorses. We'll rescue them. I think I'll collect... Maybe like 10. I think 10's a good amount. <sighs> okay, so I've made nine leads. We're just gonna go with nine because that's that's what that is. Oh, 
Darkness falls outside. Okay, so. <laughs> Let's teleport to Mars. I think we teleported to the Lucky Sheep and that's where we came across the place, the magical land. So let's get on our magical carpet and let's go find some thingies. Are they're called, oh, hi, oh my God, they're literally, oh my God, there's a shark, there's a shark. Get in, get in, get in my lasso. Oh my God, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. We need one of each color. Sir, sir, I'm gonna have to, Oh my God, get in the lasso. Where is he? Where's the shark? Okay, all right, we got a purple one. Okay, we're getting a green one. Listen, I'm gonna rescue you, don't worry. You're not, you are not a seahorse, sir. How dare you try and trick me? <gasps> You're a seahorse though. Okay, orange. I've already forgotten what colors I have. Um, That's gonna be a troubling issue. Red, I definitely didn't get. I wanna get that black one. That one was so majestic looking. Where are you? Did I get a pink and purple? I don't know. Oh, I definitely didn't get that teal one. Where's the black one? Oh, there's the black one. Okay, okay. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Yeah. Ah! Gorgeous. Okay, we need to get that teal one. Oh, look at this one. It's a multicolored one. Oh, you are so stunning. Come here, pretty girl. Ah, oh, look, at, you are so majestic. How pretty. Okay, I got that one. All right, I need a teal one now. Let's see, let's see. How many total are there? Where'd the teal one go? Oh, the shark ate it. Oh, he's a murderer. Stop eating the seahorses. Oh my God, oh my God. What's he doing? Where is he? Oh. You can eat the fish, that's okay, that's okay. Okay, we need to go find a teal one. <gasps> Whoa, getting on the magic carpet literally makes it night and day. <gasps> Hi. Oh, a family, don't mind me. I'm just here to steal you. Mm. I feel like I'm in Finding Nemo and I'm taking these poor little children away from the homes. I think this is a teal one, do you match this one? Yes, you do, come here, get back in here, get back in there. Okay, what other color did I not get? Ooh, I don't think I got a yellow. I should have a teacup color for every single version of these guys. That would be so freaking cute. Oh, look at the jellyfish. The jellyfish is so freaking cool. I wonder if they zap though. I would be scared. I bet they do. Alrighty, one more seahorse. What color did we not get? Let's go find one. Ooh, maybe like that orangey one. I don't know if we got this kind of orange. Maybe we did, maybe we didn't. If if so, I'll just capture him. We'll look, we'll browse a little bit. We'll see, hey, what ones haven't we gotten? Did I get the green one? <gasps> oh, that pink one. I don't think we got that pink one, did we? Maybe we did. <gasps> this is so difficult. Here, I want the pink one. I'm pretty sure we got purple. I don't think we got pink. Yeah, I don't recall this one. Hey, yes. Okay, we've gotten one of each. Now we should get coral to match each color. Is this a sip touch? Okay, so I think what I'm going to do for the meantime is I'm going to dig holes, a single hole for each one. I hope that like they'll be okay. Okay, now to find out which colors I actually got. Okay, that's green, pink, magenta E. Oh girl, which one are you? Who are you? Are you red? That's a red one. Oh, they're all different sizes too. I don't know if that's just like a variation or like the color makes a difference. A black one, orange. Oh, we're doing so good with picking the color. Yellow. Do we not get any doubles? I'm impressed with myself. Oh wait, is that pink or red? I don't know. That one's red. That one's definitely different, okay. Last and final one. Which one is it? Oh, girl, what color are you? What what color is that? Oh, that's the majestic one, right? That's like multicolored. Well, I feel like I should leave them here. They're each gonna get their own teacup. So the plan is to make a teapot. Now, I actually don't know if this area is gonna be big enough. I think it should be. Do you guys hear her? She is like playing crazily right now. Okay, so I wanna put like a big tea pot and then I want to put little teacups surrounding it. So I'll put nine around and they'll all be different colors. 
and the all be for a different type of color seahorse. Ah, that is so cute. But um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna work on that tomorrow. I'm gonna go gather the supplies in between episodes because you don't want to see me not in between episodes. Sorry, in between the clips. You don't want to see me go get sand and gravel. Been there, done that. So you'll see me when I have all the stuff gathered and ready to build. So see you then. Okay, you guys. So uh, I don't even remember where I left off. It's it's a brand new day and I've gotten all the supplies ready to go for the build. But like I mentioned before, I am now going to start streaming on Twitch and today is going to be my first stream. Well, not today while you guys are watching this, it's already passed, but I'm going to build the teacup thing on stream. So hopefully it goes well. If you guys want to subscribe or follow me, whatever it is over there that you do, um, the link is down below and that way you'll be notified when I do do this next time. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be streaming X life. This is so weird. I have, I don't even know. I'm nervous. I'm so scared. I don't know what streaming is, but I'm doing it. Oh gosh. Okay. So, um, yeah, this is the plan is to just put it over here. So I'm going to go do that. <gasps> oh my gosh. My babies have been kidnapped. Or maybe they died. Maybe, I mean, this wasn't necessarily the best enclosure and I did leave them here overnight. So I think we're gonna have to go on an adventure on the stream to go recapture them. Maybe they despawn. I don't freaking know. Hopefully my chat, my stream chat, since I'm a streamer now, can inform me. Um, but yeah, I guess I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys the clips from the stream of how I built, I think, I don't know, guys. This is really weird to me, but I guess I'll, I'll I'll see you in this format after. You're probably gonna see me down below there, cause on my stream my face goes down there. Okay, enough is enough. Let's just get to the damn stream. Well, hello there, my YouTube channel. So, hi. I'm streaming right now, and this is the setup for the stream. So, here is what I have so far for the teacup. No, it's not a teacup. It's a a teapot. Did I do this right? I have a picture on my phone. So this is what I have so far. Um, my colors are all here. Oh, see on Twitch we get these cool little things. I'm gonna work on the actual alerts and make them super cute in my own, but for now that's what you get. Okay, so I'm just building, but I just want to give you guys a little update. We are having so much fun on this stream, so this doesn't seem right. Okay. Well, we're just going to place it down, and if it's wrong, we'll figure it out later. But it seems right. Okay, so yeah, this was just my little update on the progress. I'm going back to the stream to listen to some music and talk to people in the chat, but we'll fill you in a little bit later. Alright guys, welcome back. I'm still streaming, but there is a killer on the loose. We need to go and stab him in the back. <gasps> it's raining! Ow! Okay, it didn't kill me in one hit. Whoa! Yeah. Death be with you. <gasps> oh my god, the spider is. I need to go upstairs. I need to go to sleep. I need to go to bed. I need to go to bed. Um, so this is the update on this, but we need to go to bed, everybody. <gasps> oh my gosh, shut the door, shut the door. Nighttime, sleepy time. No one is sleeping. Go to bed, everybody. Okay, so. Let's go take a look outside at my progress so far. And then, what is happening? Sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to not come inside my home. Whoa. How are you not dead? I don't know what just happened to him. He like disappeared. Okay. Okay, so the next thing that I need to do is create a spout for this and a handle so that's my next thing that i'm gonna work on um so again i'll update you once i figure that out okay hi youtube video again this is very strange to be switching between these two things but i just want to give you guys the update here we are on the progress of the teacup look at it's steaming oh i forgot to add the actual physical steam coming out of here 
that's another thing I need to actually make out of blocks. So I'm gonna do that. And then we're gonna move on to the teacups that will go all around the board. Um, I think I'm gonna have to actually dig into this area to make some space, but that's the update here. We'll check in with y'all in a bit. Well, I am back from the stream and that was a lot of freaking fun. I am definitely gonna do that more often. So if you guys wanna check it out and follow me and subscribe, I will leave a link down below like I've already mentioned. Also, I, at the beginning of this episode, was like, oh, I don't even know if I'm gonna hit 15,000 likes. Guess what? We've surpassed it. I believe we're at it like 20,000, so I don't have to retract that statement of doing this because I've already pretty much built it. So the basic structure is complete. Now it's time to decorate, but I wanna show you guys the finished result. So we're gonna walk down here with our eyes pointed down. Oh, what's this? There's a pathway. Whoa, okay, ready? Let's take a look. Three, two, one. Oh, wow, look at it. Here, let's go up here. Look at how freaking cute this is. So it's not done. Obviously, I still have a lot more to do. I think um, for each of the teacups, which took me so long to do. Um, oh, I should probably clean this up. There's still like little things I need to fix on them and like clean them up, but I want to get into decorating the area. So I'm gonna put the color of each flower in that area around it. But in between, I was trying to figure this out on stream, how to like get up on top of the teacups. And I ended up deciding to do a mushroom right here that I could jump onto the mushroom and then jump from the mushroom onto there. So each of them will have a little mushroom. I feel like that fits Alice in Wonderland themed. So we'll do that. They'll probably just be like red mushrooms, I think. Unless I do the color, oh, that would be good. If I do the color of the cup. So I could do like a red mushroom here, an orange, yellow, green, cyan, a black, purple, and we just won't do a pink one, or magenta. Okay, so. There's that, and then there is a sign here, and it says, Cather Catherine's Crystal Shop. Ex <clears throat> Excuse me, Catherine, what? What, 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 you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna deal with that in the next episode. I don't have time to even deal with a potential lawsuit right now because that's what would be coming. So, <laughs> so <gasps> or should it just be red mushrooms in between? Because I could just get the mushroom blocks. I think it might just be red. I don't wanna do anything too crazy as well. What is this? A red mushroom, oh! By the way, Lizzie added a furniture mod to the mod pack. So this is a new thing. It's a red mushroom lamp. <gasps> Ooh, okay, so it just requires mushrooms. Gold, oh, shoot, we're going to the nether today, guys. Wasn't expecting that. I think this might be another movie episode. I don't freaking know. Um, but the tea kettle is so freaking cute. It has smoke coming out. It has water flowing into it, the smoke coming out of there. So like I said, I'm gonna put a seahorse in each of these cups. And then in here, I was thinking this would be like the main seahorse sanctuary. So I'll probably dig this out and fill this, make make this kind of like a an aquarium type vibe. I feel very all over the place. I'm sorry about that, but it's just, it is what it is. Okay, I'm gonna get a bunch more of the aura lamps for the base floor, just so it makes it glow and it's not so dark sided. I feel very all over the place. I don't even know where to begin. So I think what I should do next is I should get the stuff for the mushrooms. So I need to go on an adventure over here. Do I have my silk touch? I'm gonna go get a bunch of the mushrooms. And then I think we're gonna go into the new nether, which is really scary because the nether is like really scary now. It's like intense. There's like really crazy creatures there now that will kill you. So I'm nervous for sure. We might die turn of events this episode. So not looking forward to that. Girl, what are you trying to say? This is my channel. Okay, I feel like this is ugly and it needs to go. Sorry, CPK, but if you're not gonna do it, I am. 
All right, so I got a whole bunch of the red mushrooms and now I just need to go to the nether and get glowstone, which I'm really scared about. I don't think anyone's selling glowstone, so I think I have to go. It's really scary. I should bring a bow. Did I enchant a bow? Maybe I should enchant a bow. Let's do it. Let's make a freaking bow because I'm sick of not having one. Whoa, what is an old bow? The guy a diamond, oh girl, a diamond bow. What is the difference between a diamond and an obsidian one? An emerald, nether star. Oh, let's do an emerald one, it's pretty and green. All right, we have the bow. Let's go enchant her and see what we get. Although, yeah, we should enchant. We should just enchant. No, maybe we should enchant a book. I mean, we already have enchanted books. Let's see if there's a good enchant for a bow. No, there isn't. I, when I was on stream, actually, I saw someone say that Joel mentioned or showed that if you get a red enchant, if you add a book to that enchant book, it will take it away. I don't know what that means, but <laughs> whatever. Unbreaking, whatever. Okay, fingers crossed it has a good thing. Life mending. Okay, let's let's try it. Let's let's try that experiment. Well, let's also maybe I should have done. Whoa, feather falling something. Hell infusion. Knockback. Okay, let's see if the book trick works. Oh, okay. I think it's on the grindstone if you add a book underneath it. Maybe. Let's see. Okay, so bow, book. Book doesn't go there. So will this just take it off of it? I guess let's find out. Maybe it duplicates it. I might as well just see. It, it consumed the bow. It consumed the bow. Okay. That was not the way to do it. All right, well, we have enough strings, so let's make some more freaking bows. What is this? A diable ponytail? <laughs> what? I don't even know what that is. Of course I'm out of levels. To Mount Flip we go. After several bows, I finally got one that has unbreaking power and punch. It should be good. Now I just need to get some arrows and I can head into the nether. <sighs> Damn, I'm nervous. I'm scared. I don't know what's gonna happen. We just need that thing. What am I looking for? Glowstone. Oh, all right, let's go into the new nether. I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the heck is that? Oh my God, so you scared me. All right, I feel like I should use my bow listen i'm just looking for some glow shroom <gasps> okay there's a dog there's a dog there hi sir i could get on my carpet maybe i should get on my carpet and fly away yeah let's get on the carpet i don't know if there's also things that like are up in the sky that will suck you up and so i hope that they can't do that while i'm on my magic carpet <gasps> Oh, girl, hi, there's a lot of scary things. This is terrifying, please don't die. I just made the five heart club clubhouse. Okay, all right, here we go, here we go. Get down, get down, no, 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 ow. Okay, nothing's up here. Let's get it and get out. Uh-oh, this pickaxe is about to break, my one silk touch pickaxe. You know what, I'm gonna add it to another diamond pickaxe so I don't lose it. Okay, you know what? I'm actually just gonna go home. I'm good. I'm good. I think I got enough. <sighs> that was so stressful. Get me the heck out of there. Okay, 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 okay. <sighs> All I wanted to do was just make a, a cute little tea area. And now it's just become so stressful. I didn't even use that bow. All right, 25 of these cute little adorable lamps. I think that's more than enough. But these... These are, I feel like, the new decoration for my area. I mean, I haven't placed them, but they look so freaking adorable. Little baby mushrooms, and they glow? I mean, come on. <gasps> oh my gosh, are you freaking kidding me? This is like a no-brainer. It's It glows, it, 
it adds perfect. Lizzie, I just want to say thank you so much for creating the perfect thing for my area. What would I what would I do without her? Truly, I don't know. I don't have to worry about the darkness. Oh! Literally the moment I say, I don't have to worry about the darkness. I have to worry about the darkness, damn it. Who is on Mika? Do not. Y'all not dying? Hello. Oh my gosh. Can you guys not, please? Maybe that would be great. I, have I not slept in a while? What's going on? They're adorable. They're freaking adorable. I need more. I need more. Okay, so I still want to add the flowers and stuff, but those add such a cute element. I actually think I need a lot more mushrooms anyways. Good thing I didn't break my silk touch. I'm going to make a new silk touch. I'm going to go get more mushrooms. I need to create like a, a little toadstool so I can jump up here and go up there. Alrighty, so now that we have this, I say we... Oh, you know what? I was actually thinking of maybe making these a staircase. Mushroom staircases could look real cute. So let's try that out. Now, my biggest worry is that this is going to just look a little too much, like too messy. Like I don't want it to be too crowded. So we'll see if this even works. Okay, what do we think? I don't think it's too bad. And then what I can do is I jump on this and then this, and then I can hop up here. I don't mind it. I don't mind it at all. I think it's cute. It fits in with the world. Let's do it again. I kind of like this mushroom better though. Maybe we have different shapes. Okay. I think it's looking so freaking cute. Now it's time to add in some of the flowers. I don't want to go too overboard again, but I just want to add some of the flowers from that color. So we're going to get our hoe. We're going to go over to our garden. The only color I don't have is the black color so oh there's nothing i can really do I, I i think the only color is like a wither rose and i don't have one of those so i think we'll leave it blank we'll eventually get black flowers so until then we will just get our hoe go over to our garden over there and harvest some flowers that we really really like so let's do it do we have a hoe on us? Hey, excuse me, you got a hoe in there? Whoa, 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 my backpack is dirty. Ooh, oh, there it is. There's my hoe. Okay, let's go get some flowers. Alrighty, so I've been hard at work off camera again, working on this area, and it looks so freaking cute. There's a couple more things I need to do. I need to get a door for the teapot, and I need to go and get the actual seahorses. So let's take a look at the new refurbished gardened area. Ready, set, look. Oh, wow. It is like a freaking wonderland. Actually though, like it's overgrown. It looks so cute. The flowers, I put all pink flowers in the center and then I put corresponding colors to the teacups. Um, oh, I should probably add a little bit more bone meal here. This looks a little... There we go. There we go. So I obviously don't have any of the black flowers, nor do I have green flowers. So I just kept it grass for now. I don't think green flowers are a thing, but I could probably go get cactuses if I want to. Um, we have gorgeous cyan. I should add some more grass over here. And then, of course, we have the yellow and orange and red. So... Now it's time to figure out a door, and there are things that are, there are white doors. They're called, well, actually, oh, mahogany, walnut. This is the one, the tooth door. <laughs> Show me your teeth. Okay, so this requires thrasher teeth, which actually Scott is selling at his shop. So we can go there and purchase those. And then I say we head off and we go re-get our seahorses oh on the stream people said to call it tea horse cups isn't that so cute so that's what this area is going to be called is the tea horse cup sanctuary and inside here i put water in and an aura floor why does it sound like there's always zombies around look how cute the map looks over there it looks so freaking cool so this is going to be where i'll put like extra 
seahorses and stuff. So I need to figure, I feel like there's a cave under here. It's annoying. We'll figure it out, but let's go to Scott's shop. We'll fly on over there and then we will go get the seahorses again. It really didn't take long to capture them, so I'm not worried. I don't know still if it's because they didn't like the space they had or whoa joe joel's build <gasps> uh-oh sorry scott let me just place those back right there for you let me put this lantern there ah good as new <laughs> sorry 64 teeth for two diamonds well i don't know if i need 64 teeth let me get my diamonds out there you go, sir. Thank you. Pleasure doing business. Now let's go get ourselves some of these little creatures. Oh, a black cat. Sakura! Sakura, come here! Come here. I'll be back for you. I know where you are. You're at the lucky sheep spawn thing. Oh my gosh, guys. We freaking found Sakura. We need to go get her. I know she's like been real mad at me. Okay. Here are the seahorses so we have a magenta one right here come here girly yellow okay magenta yellow captured Ooh, cyan yep all right who else is here oh that eel is scary it's ugly too oh it's slithery slytherin <gasps> there's a purple one oh there's a whole bunch over here come here purple did I get green? I don't remember. I don't think so. All right, we have a green one. So we need... Oh, you scared me. All right, I got the teal. I got the magenta. I got green. Okay, let's store these in our backpacks. Actually, let's let's warp home and let's slowly add them one by one. Just, just so I can keep track. Okay. Oh, we can put them first in... The sanctuary and then we'll divide them up okay so we have magenta yellow teal purple and green oh my god how freaking cute this is the cutest little sanctuary okay so we still we have one two three four five we need three more wait actually Let's go put them in their place. So magenta. Oh, girly, you need water in here. I hope they don't despawn. I will be so upset. She's living her fantasy. She loves her little teacup. I want to get like a bunch for each cup eventually, but for now we'll have one for each. I hope, I hope they're happy here. He loves it. Ow. <laughs> okay, we know he loves it. Oh wait, are you the magenta or are you purple? Uh-oh. I think I may have... Let's compare and contrast. Yeah, you're magenta. Are you also... No, you are definitely purple. Sorry, girl. All right, so they're not despawning. I think they like their new enclosures much better than their one by one. Yeah, they're still living. They're loving it. <gasps> Green, do you love your little teapot? He loves it. We need to get them all lovers, too. We'll do that next time, though. I've also realized it's really hard to run on a mushroom top, so... It uh-oh, I hope that this one can't escape and go up, up to the stars. I guess we'll find out. Girl, be safe. Don't do anything stupid, okay? You're gorgeous. You're lovely. Okay, so the only ones we need left are an orange, a red, and a black one. Okay, cool. <gasps> black seahorse, come here. Oh, the rainbow one too. Oh, girl, you go in the sanctuary. I don't know where we'll put you. You'll you'll stay in there. Okay. Where the black one? Oh, jellyfish. I don't know what they do. They seem scary. Okay, here's a black one. Gorgeous. We need red and orange. Come here, orange girl. Okay. Last but not least, we need a red. <gasps> There's one. Fabulous. I'm not sure if that's a red one. I think it is. It looks different than the other one, so we'll go with yes. L oh, yeah, that's a red one for sure. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Orange girl, orange, you glad that you're not any longer there in the ocean and you have a nice little enclosure that you're forced in? Same. <laughs> okay, the final one added to their teacup is the gorgeous, majestic black one. 
fabulous. Ah, oh, they all have their homes. They're all happy. How wonderful is that? And then we still have this magical rainbow one here. Last thing to do is add the door and then we can call it a damn day. Okay, let's pop on a door. Oh my gosh, this is truly one of a kind. This is a masterpiece. Oh my gosh, how freaking stunning is this? I say we get on our carpet. Let's take one final look from up above the world so high. Oh my gosh, Sickles. Can you even? No, you can't. No one, no one can. Let's look from the water. Oh my gosh. This is stunning. How freaking cool is this? I think this is like my favorite part of my area. Guys, give this video a freaking thumbs damn up. Oh, that that was a lot of work, guys. This this was an episode that took several, several hours. So please really mean a lot to me if you hit that like button. I also want to do something where um, I start naming these after you guys. So for every thousand likes the video gets, I will add a new name. So all you have to do is leave a like. And if it gets a thousand likes, I will rename one of them or I will name one of them you. And for you to be entered, just leave a comment of the name that you want written on there. And um, it can be your username, it could just be your name, and I will start naming these guys after you guys. So, uh, and that'll happen for every episode. We'll do a naming segment every episode. Um, so yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I did. And yeah, that's it for today. Until next time, I'll see you next time. Good damn bye.